Good afternoon. It is 520 in generally sunny South Florida, but it's nice and cool here, but sunny. It's beautiful weather. I used to call weather like this Epcot weather. Then I went to Italy and I called it Italy weather. And just weather that put me in a good mood, basically, because I'm in a good mood when I'm in Italy or in Epcot. So this is Nat King Cole. I don't know if I've ever heard that song before. I certainly have become more familiar with many of the songs. I just love the Christmas ones. Well, they're all good, right? Oh, yes. I don't know about you, but I was just swing dancing all by myself. So, <coughs> this is Driving Perilously, the show in which we turn on the radio and talk about what it is that we find. That is Legends 100.3. Taylor Morgan. This behaving. Well, it's Friday and it's Friday. 20 ish, and that ish. means it's time to choose this the week's cocktail. winner of the Legends Cocktail Tunes. All right, let's see what's on another so station. We might come back to Taylor Morgan in a minute. I don't recognize that at all. Approaching that time of year when I'm going to know every song on the radio because they're going to be Christmas songs. Not every song, but I'm going to know a lot of songs on the radio because they're Christmas songs. That is red. I mean, I'm red, but I'm not as red. Oh, there. Oh, I'm redder on this phone than my other one. This is what I, call me I don't know what that's about. Because anything you and I, we've been going to jail a long time ago. You know what I'm saying? They so, say... <laughs> a lot. Michael. How bizarre that he didn't like anything horror-esque and his biggest song is Thriller. You know, after Off the Wall album and Thriller, the album, you would have thought that next one would have just hit it out of the park, but I mean, he sure had a better career than almost everybody else, but he had already reached the pinnacle, so they say. But I don't know, I don't really, I never liked the big hit song as much as some of the others. I mean, Libby Newton John. Let's Get Physical, that's probably her worst song. She has a great voice, her songs are good, but that's, that song is, should not be in her top 10. Vincent Price. It is Halloween time. Yeah. 
Nope. Not James Taylor. I had that song on a CD, so I listened to it many times, but it's, um, it's religious. It's not James Taylor. It's a great, great CD. I wish I could find it. It might have been a tape. I think it was a, um, a compilation where every artist had one song. I like albums like that. It's great too. It's K-Love. K-L-O-V-E dot com. If you just join. Yeah. Pianist Joanne Paul joined me recently to talk about this. What's the difference between her and what I've had before? Is it, you know, an idea? Yeah, I'm just talking idea. about driving Going perilously. And, and the hope and encouragement that you get. And, stop it. And she, you she, don't, that. she don't stop. So, Give to fifteen dollars a month plus. You'll all... It's a long ending. And so uh, my great. idea was was I wanted to help people understand things going on in their life, okay. and that was really my motivation. Um, and, and most of the astrologers I knew, I was oh. actually president of the Astrological Society really? uh, the year before I was staged, <laughs> and. Huh. Um, so if you're interested in all that stuff, New Age, Astrology, adding stuff to the Bible, check out Doreen Virtue's YouTube channel. She just did a video on Sylvia Brown. <coughs> kind of like Sylvia Brown. Um, I don't like anything that she does or stands for, but I mean, as a person, someone to watch. She's very engaging. But... She and many other people are engaged in things that they should not be engaged in. And we're not supposed to talk to these entities. Whether they're products of our mind or not. Alright, so that is seven minutes in to today's episode of Driving Perilously, the show in which we turn on the radio and talk about what it is that we find. It is a Friday afternoon. We've got two shows going on, two scripts to learn. And neither one's a musical. Huh. Alright, so that's it for today's episode. Hope you are having a wonderful day. Good night, good morning, and good evening at whatever time of day this finds you. And hope you're doing well.